Joining me now is Shelly Barrett. She is the program manager for the Beaufort Digital Corridor. Shelly, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. It is our pleasure. So, Shelly, this is the third offering uh, of Code Camp in Beaufort. Is that right? Tell us about it. Yes, this is our third offering. Um, we had our first offering last year, and it's the curriculum that comes to us from our big sibling up in Charleston, Charleston Digital Corridor. And uh, we are in our third uh, iteration, and we've been doing a, a, a great job with it, and we've gotten some really good responses. Well, that's fantastic, and as we know, very, very important in uh, today's field. So tell us, who would take this Code Camp course, and what are the benefits of taking it? The course is really for adults. Um, if they're curious about coding or they're interested in maybe dabbling in some software uh, or else they want to just enhance their skills. Fantastic. Now, for this, um, are there scholarships available? How does that work? Uh, yes, we've got two scholarships available. They're sponsored by Interdev, one of our members. And uh, the scholarships, uh, if you're interested in this, please uh, email us at info at BufordDigital.com and we will get you the application. Terrific. Now, let's talk SC codes for a moment. Uh, for our viewers who don't know, first of all, tell us what that is and how does it differ from CodeCamp? Sure. Uh, we just partnered with Build Carolina and Build Carolina uh, has a collaboration with the State Department of Commerce Office of Innovation and they're offering a, a free continuing education uh, coding and that's a uh, student can do that on their own time at home or they can come to a meetup at a partner site and um, there will be mentors available and they'll be able to uh, enhance their skills and work with the other people around. Now, Code Camp is our curriculum. It's actually a guided classroom with a professional instructor. Um, this time around, we've got uh, senior software engineer Matt Shaw, and in the past, we have had USCB's uh, computational science um, associate professor, Dr. Brian Canada. So you actually have a professional guiding you through this weekly course. Um, ours is a paid course, and uh, SC Codes is the free online version. Okay, that makes sense. So you mentioned before partner sites. Um, Basecamp, will that be one, and are there any others in the area? Yes, uh, Basecamp is going to be a partner site for SC Codes, and we're uh, very proud to, to announce this. Uh, that will probably start in May, and we'll do it on a monthly basis, and we will have local mentors helping us along with that. Uh, I believe that the Don Ryan Center in Bluffton is also a partner site, so you'll probably see some things in the news uh, from both of us regarding that. Well, that certainly seems like an appropriate partnership. So we talked a lot today about uh, coding, Shelley, but other than coding, which is itself very important, is the Beaufort Digital Corridor also a gathering place for other technology? Absolutely. Uh, we are a gathering place for any kind of technology. Um, anyone that's involved in technology in the area, we want to hear from you. Um, in particular, we're trying to gather our IT professionals in order to start kind of a lunch and learn series uh, where the IT professionals can come and share their trends and ideas and that sort of a thing. So if you are an IT professional, please get in touch with us and we'll probably start doing that sort of a thing in the coming months. Very good. Shelley, thanks so much for your time. Thank you very much, Daniela. After the break, we're back with Rodney Vaughn of Coastal Stage Productions. Stay right there.